Yo, what up everyone? Sprinkle here, and I'm bringing you guys another commentary. I got a game of Search and Destroy on firing range, and I was using the G11 this game. I'm not a big fan of the G11 at all, or any other three round burst weapons, uh, for the simple fact that I'm not really good with my gun, you can say. I don't have really good accuracy, and so if I don't hit the first or second shot, I'm pretty much dead, so I really don't, you know, enjoy using these guns, unless I'm having a good night if, um... Call of Duty and my shot is really on point, then I'll probably bring the G11 or M16 out. But it's kind of a challenge to me when I use those guns. People say, you know, you're a noob when you use the gun. G11 is a noob gun. But I really suck with it, so um, I don't know why they're giving me shit for it. But I guess they don't know me, so it is what it is. But um, how would I better my accuracy? You know what I mean? I always ask people, you know, who's been playing Call of Duty for a while, and I, that's what makes. A good first-person shooter gamer, I guess you can say, is your shot. Which I guess it probably comes with time and uh, experience in the game. So I mean, I've only been I've only been playing for about a year, so I guess a little bit longer, I probably you know have a way better shot and I'll start getting more used to it. I guess I do well because I'm probably smarter than others, and you know I hug walls, I use a lot of cover, so I use you know my environment around me to do well. But today, I just got off. Black Ops just right now, and I was just playing, you know, some Search and Destroy and some Team Deathmatch, but I had to get off. There was a lot of ghosts running around, and, oh, ghosts. You know, it was brought to my attention by a good friend of mine. His name's Massacre, and he was just saying how if they switched Ghost and Scout and just swapped them out, and you'll have Ghost as a second perk. So you will have to choose from Slide of Hand and uh, Steady Aim and Warlord and all the other good perks to be able to use ghosts and I think that's the best solution for it you don't have to take it completely out of the game um, it'll make the gameplay a lot faster you know you don't have 10 minute team death matches because the whole entire team has ghost on and oh man it just gets annoying to have second chance and ghosts and reviving each other in the back of the spawn just oh uh, just a stressful night but that's what um ghosts actually opened my eyes to other game types such as you know demolition domination and all those other game types I never played before because you know the ghost faggots have to run to the objective anyways so I'll be there waiting for them they're not camping in corners tying their shoes or hanging out and time out I'm not sure what the hell they do in their corners they must be having a lot of fun but yeah I mean other than that guys I actually want to talk about YouTube partnerships you know, I started doing this, uh, I bought my PVR, and, you know, I did think about partnership and stuff like that, but if you really think about it, if you're bringing the same content as, uh, YouTubers are already bringing, such as X-Jaws, Woody's Gamertag, they're already doing what I'm doing, so nobody really cares about what I'm doing. There's so many other people doing it that I just realized that to be able to get a partnership, you will have to bring, like, this very unique content to your channel, or get a big shout out from another big YouTuber or something like that. But other than that, you're pretty much going nowhere, you know, with the same shit that everyone else is bringing. But I'm I'm enjoying doing these commentaries. I love doing them. It gives me something to do. And so I don't have an issue with doing them. I'm not in it for the money. Like, don't get me wrong. It'll be great to make money off these videos. But I'm having fun doing them. So that's all that really matters to me. And... So the people who are out there doing them, you know, you better bring some really good content to your channel and, you know, you want people to sub to you and that sub for sub crap is, you know, probably wouldn't work. It might help out just a little bit, you know, and kind of gets you out there to a little other pages, but those people don't really want to watch you, you know, and it is what it is. Um, but the game's wrapping up here, guys. I think I get an ace this round. I kill all six people and... My teammates die, and I got a verse 4. I guess that's why Search is my favorite um, game type. I love being able to clutch it. I love being last alive. It gives me a nice challenge. And I don't like to use my spy plane. Like, right now, I have a spy plane, I think. And I don't like to use it. But here it goes. I'm going to clutch it against these four guys. I just kind of outsmart them. So, if you guys can give me some feedback, give me some tips, um... Let me know what you want to see in my next commentary. If you want to see other game types, what weapons you want me to use. Let me know in the comments. You know, if you guys want to see certain a certain game type, anything. Just let me know. 
other than that give it a thumbs up um i would really appreciate it if you liked the video if you didn't like the video just give me a thumbs up double tap that button it doesn't hurt anybody and if you not if you guys are not subscribed yet and you're watching this um please subscribe it's free um i have pretty decent content on my channel it's not the best it's right, the same shit you've seen every day but i would appreciate it and after that ghost guy right there was just laying on the floor with his little ghost suit <laughs> in the corner like where they always are but yeah the guy the game's wrapping up guys um, i'm gonna kill the last guy i think he's gonna be planting the bomb here soon on b bomb and i get to the fuse final score was 11 kills one death uh one plant one defuse and it was a pretty good game i was playing against some try hard so um it felt good to beat them the last game they beat our team and I, I was only in a party with three, and they were a party of three, but we had a bunch of other noobs with us. So we beat them this game. I decided to put my try hard pants on, and yeah, I had my try hard pants, panties, uh, bra. I had all of it on, and I was ready to go. But thanks for thanks for watching, guys, and have a nice day.